I've been uh, working on these crystal power cells. These two cells here have uh, MgSO4 and uh, sodium silicate. This one has Portland in it. This battery is actually sitting at about 7 volts. Rechargeable battery. And when I was switching the cells, the, the battery is actually hooked to this cell. And then it's running through this meter which is hardly reading anything and the other side of the meter is hooked to this cell now the cells are not connected the battery is only connected through the meter which is reading low. this meter only reads a volt or so the way I have it with this 10,000 ohm resistor but what's happening here is if you can see this the battery is 7 volts and what's happening here is this is climbing. Uh, why? I don't know. It's above the voltage of the 9.6 uh, battery um, and it's climbing. And they're just in proximity. And if I can show you here, if I move them further apart, the voltage actually goes way above what this 9.6 volt battery is currently at so it really doesn't make a lot of sense you can move them close together and uh, the meter over there just goes nuts and the voltage drops here but when you move them apart there, that drops down and that climbs above 7 volts so I'm really not sure why this is happening, but I wanted to document it. Maybe somebody out there who's experimented with this can explain it. Uh, these are not connected. These cells are not connected together. There is a, a, a clear distinction. Now this meter might uh, actually be an effect in it, but if it was passing through the meter, then it would show on the meter. So, and because the voltage is actually higher than the cell I was using, to, uh, the battery I was using to charge the cell with, I'm really not sure what's happening, but it's pretty amazing. Um, now, one of the things, I, I, I it's still climbing, so I'm not sure where it's going to go. I'm going to wait and find out, but the cells have got to be acting like some kind of uh, transmitter. Now some voltage could be passing through the meter um, so I'm really not sure but I wanted to document it because it definitely has to do with the proximity of the cells to each other. So um, I'll be posting more videos later. I've shot a bunch of stuff but I'm really hot on this cell stuff right now so um, uh, give me some time here and I'll, I'll get back on the cart motor but for now um, you can see here this is still climbing so the cells are apart they're not connected other than through the meters and they are actually climbing above what the battery is sitting at 7 volts these crystal uh, power cells are pretty amazing little devices I've actually got it to pump charge a small capacitor or two so uh, there's some I've got a few larger flat cells happening and I've been using this uh, here I can't show you the logo but the seal up which is liquid glass and it's made by bluemagicusa.com so that's what I've been using as my sodium silicate so this is Technomancer for zero point fuel Signing out.